is an African no more. Oh, but them all knew me. But if I them all knew me, and if you never know this, you better know it now. With your mama Ojo, and there is no pizza. Now I love with your very big drama. But waiting for a sign, Ojo. Ah ah, Ojo. Mama, good morning. Good morning, my son. What's going on here? Mama, I decided to do small changes to the house. This is me bringing something to the table in this house. Eh? This is nice. Well done, my son. So you have been planning all this without letting me know. Mama, I wanted to surprise you. And you really surprised me. Your father will like this. You'll be proud of you. Thank you, Mama. I'm going to the next town. I'll be back later in the evening. Mama, which town? Ibadan. It's just a few hours from here. Okay, Mama. Please, buy me something when you're coming back. Okay, no problem. But make sure you take care of this house while I'm away. Oh, I see you are doing that already. You are becoming very responsible. But do not do anything stupid. Mama, I won't. I am now very responsible, like you just said. Good. That's my son. I'll be taking my leave now. Bye. And take care of the house. Bye bye, Mama. Eh? <laughs> I love it. Wow, my parents are really enjoying. Yes. Look at how big and spacious their room is. One day, I'll get married and have my own big room. And I give my children small rooms like my own. <laughs> Even the bedroom is big. It's as big as my bedroom. It's so big, it has a bathtub. Wait. Do my parents even use this bathtub? I'm sure they have not used it before. That means I'll be the first person to use it. Let me quickly use it. Before Mama comes back. A few moments later. What? Yo, what's up, my fans? <laughs> Ojo Fonts in the building. <laughs> the biggest boy in Nigeria. Africa's youngest billionaire. <laughs> you know you can be prosecuted for that. This is me. Chilling in one of my bathtubs in one of my penthouses in Banana Island. <laughs> Sipping my exotic wine. <laughs> oh my days, This wine cost a fortune. <laughs> Cheers to more life, more money, and more enjoyment like this. <laughs> hey, you niece. You niece. How could you have forgotten your driver's license? Eh? You are truly becoming an old woman. Thank God I haven't gone far. <laughs> How are you, my baby? I'm fine. <laughs> Wait, where are you? I'm chilling in one of my bottles, in one of my mom shows. <laughs> Do you want to join me? Are you serious? Do I look like a joke to you? Don't insult me. Of course, I would love to join you. Okay, I'm sending my address right away. <laughs> but what about your parents? Are 
don't want any sort of trouble or... Come on! You have nothing to worry about. This is my mansion. I don't live with my parents. Moreover, my parents are far, 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 far away! Jesus! You have nothing to worry about, baby. You can start coming now. I'll be expecting you. Life is good. Money is sweet. <laughs> Ojo, Jesus is Lord. Ojo, where is this boy? How many times would they tell you? You want to please others and displease us and displease yourself. Now they never leave you. They have left you. Quickly use the restroom before I embark on this long journey. Ah, ah! What is this one again? Eh? What is this boy doing? Who sent him to do this? Eh? I have not used this bathtub since we moved into this house, and it's here already. I wonder the magic. He wants to perform here. Identified as Amos Edos Osamudame.
Oh, Mrs. Eunice, good afternoon. You are awake. Where am I? In your house, on your bed. Ah! Uh, relax, just relax, please. What happened? Why does my head hurt? Just relax, I'm administering something that will make you feel really better. Okay, just, just relax, please. This man thinks he can dump me for another woman after dating him for five years. <laughs> not on my watch. He is very lucky he is not the one lying on this bed. Sorry. Did you say anything? No, ma. You did. I heard you say something about a man dumping you for another woman after dating him for five years. I said that out loud. I heard you. I did. Maybe I'm just overthinking. What happened to me? Um, your son said you slipped and fell, then hit your head on the bathtub. I fell? No. You flew. Sorry? <laughs> I said yes, you fell. That's what your son told me, ma. How did I fall? Did anybody push me? Oh! What kind of stupid question is this woman asking me? How am I supposed to know that? Was I here when you fell? I know you were not there when I fell. Jesus! But I can't just fall for no reason. Something must have triggered me to fall. Um, ma, your son didn't tell me what triggered you to fall. He just told me that you fell. Maybe you should just go back to coma and stop asking me silly questions. Do you really want me to go back to coma? Ah. Hmm? No, no. Since you said I'm asking you silly and stupid questions, do you want me to go back to coma? What do you mean, ma? I mean, this question that I'm asking you, is it also silly and stupid? I never said you should go back to coma or you are asking silly questions. You did. I am not deaf. Wait. What's going on? What is going on is you saying stupid things to me. But I never said anything. You did. When? Right now! Jesu! Oh my god. This woman is so weird. I'm out of here. You're the one that is weird. Come on, get out of this place. <laughs> Doctor. Huh? What's wrong? Um, nothing, nothing. My job here is done. Your mother will be okay in no time. See, I think something is not right with your mother. Doctor, I mean, isn't it why you're here? I think you should wait a little longer. No. So that you can take care of her. No, please. Take care of your mother yourself. Please, I'm Doctor. leaving. Doctor! Doctor! Mama? Are you okay? I'm fine. What happened? Um, Mama? You slipped and hit your head on your bathtub. On my bathtub? Just like that? How did I fall? Hey! God, please, oh! God, please! Why are you saying God, please? Jesus! How did I fall? Mama, I think you were running and then you missed a step and fell. I missed a step? Just like that? Yes, 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 yes. It's okay! Do you want to use yes and kill me? No, Mama. All I wanted to do was get my driver's license. Now, see where I've landed. I have missed my appointment in the battle. Sorry, Mama. <laughs> where is my phone? It's right over there. Ah! Uh -uh. No missed calls. Did you tell your father what happened? Yes, Mama. I did. So why has it been called? Maybe he's tired of you. Just like I am tired of you in this house. What did you say? Maybe he's busy. That's not what you said. Mama, that is what I said. I heard what you said. Mama, are you in my mind? You will soon find out. Come on, leave this place. Let me rest. Oh, thank God. Why are you thanking God? She's not with the man too. So you have been waiting for me to chase you out, right? It can't be possible. Come on, leave this place. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. It 
been more than six hours. And family hasn't called me yet. Okay. No problem. No problem. Ah. I'm sorry for wasting your time. But you need to leave now. I mean, right now. But why? I just came not quite long. And you know you said we'll make use of the bathtub together. I... I know. But it's a bit of an issue. What issue? Say that I is the baby and you're waiting with this. Okay! Okay! What's going on here? Good evening, ma. Who are you? I'm Rose, a, f a friend of Ojo. A friend of Ojo? Ojo, how many times have I told you to stop bringing ladies to my house? Ladies? Yes! <laughs> ladies! Rose, it's not what you're thinking. I can explain. It is exactly what you're thinking. Mama, please. Why are you begging me? I thought you said you don't live with your parents. You told me that this house is one of your mansions. Mansions? He's not even a man yet. Where is he going to get the show from? Ojo, at your age, you have started lying to ladies. Mama. Don't mama me. You that I am still feeding and clothing, you already have the guts to bring a lady to my house, calling it your own. But mama, this is not your house. This is daddy's house. Ojo, you cheat and you're also a liar. I swear, I won't lie to you. And I will never cheat on you. Eh? Mama, will you just shut up? Jesus is Lord! Rose, I will never lie to you. And I will never cheat on you. I swear, I love you. I don't believe you. I don't, I don't believe anything you are saying. Please, believe me. Rose, huh? I have closed my eyes. Before I open them, I want you out of this house. Okay. Okay. Rose. Don't come close to me. Please. Don't say my name. Hear me out. Rose! Rose, please, hear me out! Rose! What kind of a wicked mother are you? How dare you interfere in my conversation? Maybe you should have just remained in coma. Ah! Hadi be here, I know you now. I did be here, this is like what you want. It's okay. Mama, mama, mama. It is you that we go back to coma. And if you're not careful, I will send you to that coma today. Mama, why did you slap me? You think I didn't hear you? You are telling me to shut up. What? Me, your mother. I carried you for nine months. And you are telling me to shut up. Maybe I should have shot my legs the day your father and I decided to form you. I think it would have prevented this insult. After everything I have done for you, you are calling me a wicked mother. Hey! Do you know who a wicked mother is? Someone who deprives you of good food, good clothing, good school, good this, good that. Have I ever deprived you of anything? And you are calling me a wicked mother. After everything I have done for you, you still wish I was in a coma ah! because of a girl you just met? But mama, I never said all these things. You must have not said them with your mouth, but your mind. Says them all. How do you know I said them in my mind? Because I can read your mind. You can read my mind? How? Mama, I'm just asking because I'm confused. Ever since I woke up from this coma, I have been reading mind. So that means you can read what I'm saying in my mind. Are you deaf? Did you hear what I just said? Maybe I should just pack my things and leave this house for you. When you're leaving, yes! make sure you leave the way you are. Oh my God! Mama, you read my mind. Mama, you read my mind. You're a mind reader. Are you packing out or not? Pack? Pack to where? But you said you want to leave. No, Mama. I only said that in my mind to know if you're truly a mind reader. You will move out of this house. Mama, I'm sorry for telling you to shut up. And... Also wishing you were still in coma. Are you sure you're really sorry? Actually, no. Yes! Mama, yes! 
Mama, yes. Mama, it's my mind. It's messing with me. Mama, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Apology accepted. Thank you, Mama. This one is none of my concern. What concerns me now is I am hungry. I want to eat. Really? Mama, what do you want to eat? I can prepare anything for you. You? Cook? Since when did you start cooking? You that the only thing you know is to eat, eat, eat and eat. Mama, this is the new Ojo standing in front of you. Like you said, I am not responsible and I can cook. Okay, what can you cook? I can cook jollof fufu. What? I can cook coconut beans. I can even make plantain burger. I can also... It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Plantain burger. D don't worry, I'll prepare the food myself. Mama, it's going to be nice though. I said don't worry. I'll prepare it myself. Plantain burger. Jollof fufu. Ew. Wow. So mama can read my mind now. Odo, you better stop talking. I can read your mind from here. Hey, Odo, oh yeah, please stop thinking. Stop thinking. Stop thinking. Stop thinking. Stop thinking. Stop thinking. Please stop thinking. Stop thinking. Oh, stop thinking. Stop thinking. Stop thinking. Stop thinking. <laughs> What's going on? Where is everything in my room? <laughs>